We are playing Grixis Vampires in Explorer using Lord Xander the Collector as our newest vampire from Streets of New Capenna and trying to cheat him out into play with Soren, allowing us to put a vampire instantly into the battlefield from our hand, which allows us to get our seven mana Xander out on turn three. So he's actually been in the Discord in the description down below, so make sure you join and we'll see how the games go. Okay, okay, we will keep this start off with a haunted ridge. He's playing mono red. Okay, is this the same deck that we've been just went against? There's our Soren. Go ahead and play Voldaren and Bloodcaster. See what he decides to do. Voltage search. Okay, Haunted Ridge, play the Soren. Here we go. Oh, minus three Soren. Get out Xander. He will discard two cards. There's the concede. Right out instantly. On to the next one. Okay, okay. I think we keep this. So I have a Xander's Lounge. Elvish Mystic. Go ahead and play Voldaren Bloodcaster. Cultivate. He is ramping. Play Florian. Swing for two. Unfortunately, we can't play. Um, cannot play Soren yet. So we'll throw him out in the back. Go ahead and play Dragon Skull Summon. Swing with both. You will block with the Solemn Simulacrum. That's fine. Draw his card. Swing for two. I will play Bloodcaster. Radiant Fountain. Another salt. Ramming up really high. Cultivate. Sure. Extremely high. And I think we're going to get Ugin. So I am going to save the devil. Go ahead and play Soren. Sacrifice Florian. Deal damage to his face. In case Ukin does come out. There's another Radiant Fountain. Swings at Soren, which is interesting. Another Solemn. So he's not Ugining yet. Cultivate. He's just getting a bunch of lands. Elvish Mystic. I will discard a blood crit, get a fable. 
discard a ritual set. Get a bedevil. Play Fable of the Mirror Break. Put a vampire from my hand onto the battlefield. Go ahead and swing. Florian comes out. Um, go ahead and just exile a land. Play the land. Pass the turn. So we do have a devil mana for Ugin. If it does come out this turn. Ugin the ineffable. That was not the Ugin I was expecting. Okay, kill Olivia, that's fine. Go ahead and kill... We just win, right? Kill the Selvish Mystic. Yeah, good game. I think we have to mulligan this. Ugh. I might have to mulligan this one too. Definitely think we mulligan this one too. We are first as well, which is a problem. This is bad. Okay, never mind. Thank God. <laughs> he just conceded. Well, we won't count that, but we'll go on to the next one. Um, so I think this is extremely keepable. We have Soren. We don't have Lord Xander yet, unfortunately. And I don't think we want to run out Soren until we can play another vampire before then. Trail of Crumbs. Interesting. Haven't seen a food deck in a while. Okay, so we are just going to keep this going. That's an interesting way to use the food. Gilded Goose, sure. Get more food. I don't think we want to kill it. We'll go ahead and just play Blood Vile Purveyor. He will deadly dispute the food again. Get a Fable. Fatal push. Unfortunate for me. Witch oven, that's fine. Mayhem devil, that's what we want to kill. So we will go ahead and a devil. A mayhem devil. Get him to use his witch oven on it. Unfortunately, I think he's gotten enough value to where he's going to run away with this game in the end. 
Unless we can start pulling our Lord Xander soon. Play Blood Tithe Harvester. Has a cauldron familiar. Trail of Crumbs. Go ahead and play Blood Vial Purveyor. Now the only question is Oh boy, yeah. Alright, this cauldron loop with double trail of crumbs is gonna give him everything he needs. If Blood Vial lives, it's good. Blocks with the cauldron familiar. Unfortunately, Blood Vial does not live. Okay. So our outs are Olivia. Xander's not really an out anymore. We need Olivia for Blood Vial. Westgate Regent. There's Corvald. Great, now we have Corvald to deal with. Another trail of crumbs, sure. Discard the blood. Um, blood on the snow, also an out. Got another land. Go ahead and play Florian. Swing for three. Can't really do much else. So we really need a blood on the snow here. Oh, he's just getting so much value out of and drawing so many cards. That is not a blood on the snow. I think that's game. I won't be able to do anything against. This Corvold. We will Darren Bloodcaster. Play Soren. Plus one Soren on Florian. Go to combat. Swing for four. He will just cauldron for me familiar. Yep, yep. 
No blood on the snows. Ritual soot wouldn't even help. Oh, he just straight has a fatal push there. Okay, well, that blood token trigger did save us if we get a land next turn. So we'll keep it going. Still just looking for blood on the snows. Really our only answer. Drawing all the cards. This is all my turn too. <laughs> he still has a full hand. There's the Mayhem Devil again. Another Mayhem Devil. He says good game. Yeah, all right, he got there. He knows what to do. On to the next one. Okay, okay. This is actually not bad of a hand. Maestro's Theater. Okay. Go ahead and play Knight of the Blood, or Knight of the Ebon Legion. Wall of Lost Dots. Mill four. Go ahead and play Voldaren Bloodcaster. Pass it. So he's playing Mill. That was not the greatest Tasha for him. I will go ahead and play this swing. Okay, there goes my second Soarin. Okay, well this is starting to become a very big problem. So we just want to go here now. And I think we just want to burst him down. Alright, how many more cards do you have? I have six cards. Oh, six cards. The next mill deck he has is probably mill card he has is probably the last one. All right, no mill, no mill, no mill, no mill. No, oh my God, he had it. He had it. He had it. He had it. Okay. Can't really do anything there, unfortunately. On to the final game. This is a bit of a risky keep, but I am going to take it. Unfortunately, we haven't gotten Xander and Soren out together very many times. We did get it our first game. <laughs> we saw basically the insta concede there. But we, we can get another land by turn three. And this hand becomes playable. Um, go ahead and play. Bloodcaster, I think. Risen Reef. Alright, so this could be many things. And if it's the 
Grinning Ignis combo with Berkey. I'm going to be very sad. He hasn't played out a red mana yet, so maybe it's not. It could also just be straight team elementals. It could also just be green blue ramp. Which looks like is what it is. Leaf Kindred, sure. Um Swing both here. Play Fable. Okay. Okay, okay. Cavalier Thorns. That is problematic. There is an Agent of Treachery too. Swing for six. I don't think I'm winning this, unfortunately. I think that one missed land drop at the end really costed me. Discard you, discard you. Okay, play Blood Tithe Harvester. Go to combat. So we can go with these two. Ah, uh, Nissa. Going to grow spiral. The question is, can I make it out of this? And how do I make it out of this? Well, Crosses for f draws four cards. Oh boy. All right, do this blood caster. Activates. Get land or else. Okay. This card. Flurry. The devil. This card. Xander. Flood Tithe Harvester. Uh oh. Wow. We. Didn't get a land. Okay. Yeah, he got there. On to the rifle. And that was Grixis. Vampire, Tribble, and Explorer. Off to a good start. I got the combo basically exactly on turn three in the first game. But our last couple games in the end there. 
did go unfortunately. Missed the land drops, missed some just enough damage to get over the edge of what we needed. As always, that will be in the Discord in the description down below. Make sure you join. And thanks for watching.